Hello, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. My name is Flo McNasty. I appreciate you guys clicking on the video, coming to check out how to make your game look better or like all of the streams or videos you've been seeing. I know that I wondered how to do it. So the first thing you're going to want to do is open up the GeForce experience. You're going to want to click the settings tab right from the home screen. You're going to have to make sure that this enable experimental features, a GeForce experience update may be required. You want to check that on. Once this is checked, you will be able to use the NVIDIA shaders in-game. Life-changing, let me tell you. I'm super excited to show you. All right, what you're going to want to do in-game is push Alt-Z. This will bring you to the GeForce Experience overlay. You're going to want to click on this game filter here. Now, when you click on it, it may ask you to restart the game, and that's just because it hasn't applied it properly yet or something on the back end. I don't know. I'm not a genius. Once you're in the game filter, it will give you three different options you can use. So you can add filters to each option. I don't want to put it on one. That's where my current filter is. So I will now switch over to my filter. You can see the vibrance the lighting the sharpness it's unreal it's life-changing game changing i know i've said this multiple times and i know you're getting annoyed with me what you want to do is you want to click add a filter and you want to add your color and then you want to go in here and you want to change the tint maybe you want to change the tint intensity you want to change the temperature it's totally up to you whatever you'd like to do but if you go to over to mine you can copy my settings i think this works the best you can adjust it based on your needs and what you think looks the best feels the best it's totally up to you so my sharpen i'm at 100 percent ignore film grain i'm at 40 percent now the film grain is a personal preference once again you can change that you can go all the way up it makes it a little bit smoother you can go all the way down it makes it a little bit sharper i personally like it right at 40 percent and that's my personal preference next up under the color tab make sure that you add the filter color my tint color is zero my tint intensity is zero now I can turn this up or down, whatever you'd like, but I like it at zero. And then my temperature at zero and my vibrance 100%. So this is where it usually is at five. We're going to turn that way up and it's just going to give you way better colors, better feeling. It's going to just make your game better, allow you to see enemies better. It's, it's really great. It also makes your inventory look really cute too. So once that's all set, um, you're basically ready to go. It looks great. You're going to be killing PMCs in no time. Those scabby boys aren't going to be killing you too, too hard uh, as they normally do. OP scavs for the win. Remember, guys, I'm live five days a week over at Flo McNassie underscore TV. I would really appreciate it if you come check me out. 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on the weekdays, 10 a.m. on the weekends. I hope to see you guys over there. And uh, ciao for now. We'll see you next time. Peace.